light. <laughs> Morning, guys. Morning, guys. Good afternoon, actually. Afternoon. True. It is 2 o'clock. Anyways, let's go on into town and check some dumpsters. Want to check some dumpsters? Anyways, <laughs> wish us luck. Say good luck. Hit the like button. We're almost there. And get into some dumpsters. Dumpster, dumpster. Hopefully not full of juice. Guess what? It's freaking sleeting. I am not ready for this weather. It makes me mad. But it is what it is. So, let's go see what we can find. <laughs> we just hit it! I'm gonna show you a sneak peek in the trunk. And we're at Ross slash Michaels. Guys, it's so cold I have to have my gloves on. Look guys, <laughs> yay, I'm so excited. Oh look what Aaron already found, cute. Well, only the glass is busted. We got plenty of glass. Frame that's not put together? I don't know. Huh. Whoa. Don't really see a use. Oh, that is a frame. Yeah, it is. Grab that other one. That's one that you're right. It's not put together. It must have been a custom order. See you at the next one. Guys, there's a employee throwing stuff away right here, but he's going through it too. Aaron's gonna check. This is Bed Bath and Beyond. He's got stuff. Be right back. Junk. Junk. Are you dish? We're at Radio Shack. Radio Shack, guys. I have a YouTube channel. Nice. What are you gonna do with all this? Throw it in there? Yep. So we can take it. Yes, ma'am. We can take it. Oh. That's awesome. I'm an avid dumpster diver, so. Are you really? It, you awesome. <laughs> nice to meet you. Yeah. <laughs> I'm Ryan. This is my husband, Aaron. Yeah. That's old busty. Looks a like lab, it's drone laptops, huh? You go around here on town, I assume. Yep. I used to, I've lived all over the country, but I used to live in uh, Pocatello, and then I moved to the other side of Montana, over there, back to Nice! Now I'm here, so. <laughs> That's cool, huh guys? No, we saw you and we were like, oh crap, employee. Because you know, you don't want to really get caught by the employees. Some are really rude. Yeah, some don't. And then we saw you going through it and we were like, wait, he's going through it. Let's go up there. <laughs> that must be another yeah. Thing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I need this. I know exactly what this is. Look for our what you call it gun. Oh, yeah. Aaron's getting in, guys. He's going in deep. <laughs> going in deep. <laughs> Oh, what's going on in here? What is going on in here? These are, this looks like a magnetic uh, switch for a door. It's kind of like an alarm. Really? Yep. Well, okay, fine. <laughs> cool.
Cool scores, guys. Cool scores. Is there anything else in here that you might want to take? I don't think so. I'm coming, babe. I'm so sorry. I got sidetracked. Yeah, these hooks, those are expensive. Guys, I'm going to have to put you down. Well, baby just definitely got his fair share of dumpster juice. <laughs> We're debating taking this. It's pretty busted. Uh, it's busted. Let's leave it. We don't need it. We got plenty. But check this out, guys. We got these. And if y'all find these ever... Wow. <laughs> Anyways, if y'all find these ever, take them. Because these are hooks. And, you know, these things right here... And the balls on the end, you can use them in your home. That's what we're going to do. We're going to take them off of these and use them. Because look at all the rods that we find in the other dives that don't have ends or the little hooks. And now we're going to be able to have those. So we have three of these. These are going to have to go in the back seat. No. Guys, we did good so far. We've only hit two. Well, three. Guys, I'll tell you what we did lose is trunk space. Big time. <laughs> and that sucks, but you know, we make up for it in gas mileage and knowing that we have a car that isn't gonna break down on us, so that's good. Not bad. I must say, that was pretty cool meeting that guy. He was really nice and uh, he was he was grabbing stuff like little circuit boards and stuff too so i thought that was really neat love to meet other dumpster divers of course he's like i'm an avid dumpster diver. yeah and i got that all on film i don't know how much of his face i got but i did ask him if he if he minded being filmed he said no so that was awesome aaron knew it too he was like let's go up there he's he's keeping stuff I was like, no. He's like, trust me. I'm like, okay. So that was pretty nifty. We're going to go check the pet store. And then um, we already checked TJ Maxx. It was nothing. Nothing much at Ross. A couple frames. So we'll check the pet store. And Dollar Tree. And then we're going to head home and do a haul for you guys. Hopefully, if we get there before Aaron has to go to work. We already have. We are a huge freaking haul sitting in our living room waiting for you guys but we just haven't had time we've had appointments all freaking week and we haven't had time to go through it yet and then when we get an Ulta haul we got to go through it right then because it's souped you know and if you just let it sit there everything will be ruined so we can't do that so the Ulta one will be first anyways <laughs> we're headed to the pet store see you in a second not a bad little pet store haul. We got a fish tank filter, a couple of vests, a plug, a Ferminator, a bag of dog food, a small one that's ripped on all kinds of sides. But we found the whole pieces to this guy and the filters. So yeah, not bad. Cool little staples haul. We got a pet carrier. There's a filing cabinet in there. And it's not in as bad shape as the last one, but guys, we're packed. Which sucks because Aaron's been wanting one, but anyways, we found paper, markers, pens, and this cool little tote, and this pet taxi. These sell quick, guys. I don't know why that was in there. Someone throws their trash away here, which is bullshit. But anyways, see you in a minute. It's cold. Oh, drive. Okay, so we're pretty packed, and since we have a huge haul at home, um, we're just gonna go home. We only had one stop left, which was Dollar Tree, and heck with it. <laughs> we're packed and we're cold, and Aaron's gotta work tonight, so there's that. So let's go home and do this haul. We're home, and like I told you guys, we have a huge haul already here. But now we have this Ulta stuff, and it's souped, like you can see the top and the bottom. So here's what we're going to do. I'm going to scratch the intros for that haul because it's freaking massive. 
and I only have Aaron for another hour before he has to go to work. So, we are going to do this Ulta haul real quick. It's going to be part one. I'm going to try to get it up tonight. Aaron will come home in the morning. We'll film part two, which will be that massive ass week long haul. So, you guys stay tuned for that and let's get into this haul. All right, guys. Um, this part might probably be fast forwarded. We never know how long it takes to go through this, so but let's get started. I run and spread these out. Okay. Guys, I'm worried because it's so wet. That's what she said. Ready guys?
It's only missing one color. Perfect oh, condition. I've never found, never, oh. 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 Hold on, slow down, Turbo. What is What's that? What's this? This is Flash. a lash case. What is this? Serum. I don't know. Oh, they're in here. This is a lash case and they're in here. I don't know what this is. I'm about to find out what this is. What? My God! Whoa! What? What is that, dude? I bet this is worth a lot of money. Fortifying Let me see that. spray. Guys, I don't well, know what this listen, is. Listen, shiitake mushroom extract, grape pro sunnite <laughs> essential oils. Rosemary extraction. Oh, that's what it is. Look, look. Get the strengthening shampoo. Really? Strengthening. Here's the brush to the Urban Decay palette. Yeah, that's what it is. Can you wipe the box off? Box off. <laughs> box off. The Body Shop little body lotion. Yay. Wow. I couldn't even imagine how much this I costs. bet this is expensive. Oh, yeah. Extracts are really expensive. Always. What is the... T I mean, I know that they put them in here, like put them in baggies or whatever, but if they're going to soup them anyways, this doesn't make sense to me. <laughs> Not bitching about it. Box just so saying. Good. That dumpster was full of Urban Decay boxes, so I knew, I just Meek. was really afraid that they were going to be real bad. More, yeah, more caviar, anti-aging. Saved it. This is still good. shade is it yeah that's awesome
Well, my shade missing saved it. <laughs> That's weird that it's all the way at the bottom of this. Weird that I was able to save it. <laughs> Okay, the only thing left in the bottom of this one is lids and super, super shampooy soup. So I'm literally gonna like put it in a tote, God, take it to the tub, wow. and like just run water all over all of it just to save the lids. And we're gonna move on to these bags. Bag number one after box number two. Oh, this mat is a mess. Remember, when dealing with soup, or something you don't give a crap about. Oh. Here's the box to all that. Cool. $30. This one I found on the bottom of the Ulta dumpster. When I got home, I repressed that one because it was falling apart. But it's Urban Decay, and it's gorgeous. Acne started. Oh, yeah, we have this whole set. I think that might go to that. It does. Pee -pee, go lay down, baby. Ouch. That's what that that goes to right here. Look, guys. Nice. Lids. Nice. In the box. Whoa, what is this? Hot rollers. What the heck? <laughs> cool. T3. <gasps> You're ki oh, there's one busted. Look, but here's the piece to it. It's a T3. Are you serious? Yeah, so it's T3 on the front. Guys, it's a T3 hot roller set. T3 stuff is so expensive. I don't honestly see how that little piece would stop anything from working or that one. It's this not even is... cut. This box looks to be just oh, like lids and stuff. <clears throat> Felt like Good because we needed these. Yeah. Not that we don't have enough. No, but these are the ones to our products. Bag number two. Oh. Wow. Freaking score. I don't know what it is, but score. It smells good. Wow. What is it? Freshening water mist. Foam hand scents. Foaming hand soap. Wow. Lavender mint. This is a whole package of Ulta hand soaps. Wow. They... Now that doesn't make any sense. They could use them in the bathroom. Or whatever. So all that's left in here is boxes. We are going to take this stuff to the bathtub real quick, rinse it off, and we'll see you in a minute. <laughs> Alright guys, we got most of it. Well, no, we got all of it cleaned up. And we were able to save a ton. So yeah, okay. So this Ulta Dive is from last night, as we guys told you. And we're going to scratch all the intros and everything from those four hauls and we're going to do them all in one in a part two to this video so stay tuned for that but let's get into this haul ready all right so here's the palettes that we were able to save we saved the naked palette actually it was right on top 
nothing wrong with it. That is insane. And then there's a couple of these um, It Bye Bye Breakout Concealers, a little mousse, a Physician's Formula eyeshadow. There's two of those. But um, I couldn't say, that's just the boxes for everything. Remember, save your boxes, guys. I couldn't save the package for it. And then here's a Tarte um, bronzer. I washed these and blow dried them. These were fine. These are in here. These were in the package, so I was able to just wash the package. As with this one, it's just drying. Uh, will you open that? We got a butter bronzer. I love Physician's Formula. Oh gosh, it's so soft. Look at that. Anyways, and then we got a Tarte Hamptons Weekends. This thing is magnetic. I'm going to clean that up a little bit more, but all three of these pop out and they're magnetic as well as this one. Other side. These pop out too, and again, I need to clean that up a little bit better, but hey, I was able to save it, so yeah. And then I think I showed you guys this one last night. And I already repressed that one because it was falling apart. Those are beautiful. And then we've got the get, be real careful, open this one like it is because it's got a busted shade. I just got to fix this one shade if I can scoop it well. I guess it's missing that one, but other than that, it's perfect. It's BH Cosmetics. I've actually been going to buy this one several times and haven't. And then last but not least, we got this Urban Sin, and we got this in another dive, but we were not able to save it at all, like barely any of it. And I'll just take a Q-tip and get this top layer off with some alcohol, and these ones ain't even touched. But yeah, that is crazy, and I'm going to keep this one. And that Naked palette, I've been waiting months and months to find some Urban Decay. Oh yeah, and then this thing is full. I'll insert the price of whatever I can to make the video not so long, because that's why we're having to do a part two as well. So I don't want to spend too much time editing it, you know? Want to say bye? Bye. <laughs> Guys, we are at 993 it's seven. Seven. <laughs> we need seven subscribers and we're going to hit a thousand. Which I'm sure by the time this video is up we'll already be over. We're going to hit a thousand. We're going to hit a thousand. I'm so freaking excited. I don't know. Guys, what are we going to do for a giveaway? I want comments down below. Ideas. I want to know what you guys want for a giveaway. Ah! Anyways, let's finish this haul. Love you. All right, so remember we got the curlers. Those are the T3. Again, those are just boxes. So here's a few of the things that need to be fixed in this hot well aside from this, but I'm going to wash that. So this has um, found, uh, shape tape all over the outside of it. This one's busted. This one's busted. This one's actually not. So what is that, blush? Yeah, that is blush. And then this is the little thing for that. For this guy, so I'll probably just let that dry real flat and then super glue this back on or whatever. And then there's a face mask. And then, then we got all of these tea tree oils. My whole freaking house smells like tea tree oil and I'm not happy about it. <laughs> we got one, two, three, four of the tea tree oils and one of the crew daily shampoo for men we got a bag of five one two three four um fresh water mist foaming hand soap which is really weird to me but um we got a it i already washed these that's they're still a little wet because i washed them with brush cleaner but we got a love beauty fully it cosmetics big beautiful brush this thing is going to be re really big whenever it's dry i'm sure that is just gorgeous and then we got a luxe performance oh bare minerals contour brush it looks like and then this one's still wet really wet oh this one needs rinsed more even this is a bare minerals foundation brush it's got the little gap inside you know 
I'm going to rinse that here in a minute more. And then here is the um, brush to my Urban Decay Naked Palette. We got eyelash curlers. We got um, these things were are all already had um, the lid still on them too, which is freaking insane. Except for these two right here, there was this and a tart, and I think that I might have uh, the lids to them in another bin. So I'm gonna check that. That's why I always keep my lids. So I got a Gimme Brow, a Maybelline Brow a little something drying cream I don't know but that's strange one two three three Maybelline Superstay lippies a melted lippy a NYX lippy a essence lip liner tart Creaseless concealer. We got a man eater, tart man eater mascara. Lancome Super Extreme mascara. Uh, another um, precision brow pencil. Also, uh, we found that, honey, it's in my purse. That clicky pencil. It's right in the front zip pocket. We bring it here. And then another Maybelline lippy and a Bare Minerals lippy. And then a lip scrub. And then this It Cosmetics foundation. If I can get it open. <laughs> That's still in great shape. Right, it's in great shape. <laughs> oh, That's funny. All right, that's all for that bin. That needs to be rinsed, so I'm gonna leave it right there. And then we, I also got this um, pencil right here, and it is brand new. You just twist it, and the little uh, makeup comes out of the end there, and it's got all the little colors like the clicky pins when we were kids. That is insane. I've been wanting one of these. I almost bought one from Blue Roses, and I was gonna get it this payday. And now I found one, so <laughs> yay! Anyways, moving right along, moving right along. We got two of these caviar fillet fix treatment. Um, I assume it's for yeah, damaged for damaged hair. A melted lippy, another melted lippy. We got Clinique. I don't know, Aaron ke accidentally kept those. We got a color corrector. Remember, if it sharpens, it's savable. Those are Physician's Formula. Physician's Formula Foundation. What is this? Well, if I have a lid for this, I guess I'll keep it. I'm sure I do over in that bin right there. So then there is a little... um Shea Butter Body Lotion, an Ulta Onyx um, Cream Eyeshadow, more of these IT Cosmetics CC Creams, Honey Come Up, a Bye Bye Under Eye IT Cosmetics um, Concealer Thingy. NYX, um, a NYX liner, a new Wet n Wild hairbrush, I gotta redo this one, but it's a velvet blush, we got the Kenya Platinum Working Wax, this thing's full, well, trust me, it is, I can't get it open, and then there's two of these guys, and they're full, and then there's two of these guys, and they're full. And these little single shadows, I tell you what, they can be down in the bottom. And as souped as it can be, but they're sealed so good that they survive every time. And then this needs to be repressed as well, but it is still sealed. 
And then this needs to be repressed, but it's also still sealed. And then a Physician's Formula Blush. Murad Water Gel. Another Juice Beauty. Bare Minerals Powder. Bare Minerals Powder. This is a little set right here. And it all goes together with that little tiny one I just had. Anyways, y'all seen it. And then a NYX single shadow that needs to be repressed, but it looks really pretty. And, and then there's two of these Too Faced Born This Way foundations. And then there's several of these little compacts here. The Physician's Formula Color Correctors. And I have a lot of these little new and then more NYX Can't Stop Won't Stop Foundation and uh, Laura Geller Foundation in the box, a Milani highlighter. This one needs fixed up a little bit, but hey, still a lot of good shades. This is Dose of Color. So these... I think I can get into these without having both hands. Uh, there we go. Yay! So yeah. So those go like that. There's several of these. And we have the green and yellow and the pink and purple. And then, um, Clinique, um, hydrating gel, we got some Yes to Coconut Hydrating Energizing Coffee Scrub Cleansing Stick, uh, Shape Tape Foundation, Fair, I'll be keeping that. I think that's one of those tools to help you put your mascara on, but I'm not sure. And then... Another Can't Stop, Won't Stop foundation. If it will stand up. <laughs> Why? And then these are all... Jeez, come on, man. <laughs> these are all caviar um, hair oils or hair product. And it's just a ton. Oh, that's Clinique for the face. But the rest of this stuff, except for this, that's a 48 hour bamboo something or other. And then there's even more of these in this other tote I'm about to show you. Except for this is the Sebastian Potion 9. And then an elf. But yeah, here. And then this is full. So, um, there's a whole bunch of these caviar, um, hair oils and hair anti-frizz gel, and they're all brand new. Color hold, anti-frizz gel, anti-frizz dry oil. Yeah, I bet these are kind of spendy too, guys. We'll insert prices for those for sure. Moving right along. Tote number two. Got some Biage shampoo. We got some Kenra conditioner. More Physicians Formula. More Physicians Formula. More Physicians Formula. Here's some more of that. Uh oh, I wasn't closed all the way. <laughs> Piper, she's sitting on her toy. Do you see that? <laughs> what the heck are you doing? Back up. Back up. She's such a dork. <laughs> another hair oil. And another one. And another one. <laughs> and another one.
another CC cream foundation and some number seven lift and luminate gotta find the lid for this one but it's color correcting concealer more physicians formula here's some more to that little set right there more caviar that is an odd name for Dermalogica ooh I'm gonna keep this stress eye lift we got my favorite mascara in the world but of course I found it in brown doggone it this is my favorite guys this is I highly recommend this mascara right here in black some Ulta foundation some Maybelline foundation some Smashbox Minimize, oh wow, Minimize Pores Photo Finish, I, didn't, I thought that was Maybelline, I didn't realize it was Smashbox, wow. Some Bare Minerals, 24 Hour, Fam More Physicians Formula, some Bare Minerals Original, I think that's a little set, that little Bare Minerals stuff. And then, oh, there's one of these in the bathroom that's pink. I don't have a lid for it yet. But I think it's just color correcting type or whatever. So we got two of those Redken. I'll, actually, I'll just fill that up and make one. And then there's this DP Hue Renew Shampoo. More DP Hue Daily Color Shampoo. DP Hue Shampoo. DP Hue Boosting Gloss Conditioner. Deep Conditioning Treatment. Burnt Copper. Huh. That sounds messy. Um, daily Conditioning Care. Hair Building Fibers. This is more caviar. Oh, Lord. My hands don't want to work. Body Building Volume Conditioner. Look at all that caviar. Jeez Louise. Dermalogica. More Hue. More Physician's Formula. Um, Diva Curls. This is some a good product. I use the shampoo and stuff. Um, I had never seen this before until now. That's some Clinique Foundation. Here's the little other rest of that thing. And, oh, I bet this goes with this. What do you bet? Yipper, yipper. So there's that little set and that little set and this little set. <laughs> we got some little sets going on, don't we? And then this, oh boy, that needs washed. A little bit better. And then some St. Tropez Tan Enhance Moisturizer. Oh, here's more to that bamboo set. Check that out. Cool. So there's more to that bamboo set. And, oh, crap, more. So there's those. And then caviar protein cream for damage free hair. Hmm, I'll be the judge of that, caviar. We got some sexy hair, hot sexy hair 450 control me spray. Deep clay cleansing, Freeman feeling beautiful. Honey tea tree, ooh, tea tree oil. Why is it everywhere? Why? Mudslide nourishing hair mask from Dry Bar. Oh shit, keeping you. Dry Bar. <laughs> Pureology strength cure. Best blonde. I'm a blonde. Um, AG Hair Care Recoil Curl Activator. Gentle Foaming Face Wash by Elemis. Clinique Acne Solutions Cleansing Gel. I actually think we have um, more of these in the bedroom in there, and maybe we can make a bigger set. And here's another part of it Acne Solutions. Oil cleaning mask. Maybe I'll just send those to Bear. She probably needs those. Um, caviar anti frizz blowout butter. Two of these, and I think that's it. And that's all, my loves. 
So yeah, guys, we were able to save all this, all this, all this, all that, and all that, and all that, and those, and those, and that, and that. <laughs> That's it and that's all for this video. Stay tuned for that haul back there in part two. Hopefully tomorrow, if I can, it's going to be a lot of stuff. I hope it doesn't turn into a part three. It very well could because that's a week's worth of stuff. Anyways, <laughs> so I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to comment down below and let me know what you want to do for the thousand winner giveaway. And share this video. Like this video. You guys know what? 75% of my viewers are not subscribed. What's wrong with you guys? Don't you like my videos? Subscribe! <laughs> Anyways, comment down below. Let me know what you want to see next. And see you in the next video.